Hi, everyone. I'm Mark Peek. I'm a principal engineer with VMware. I work in the cloud native team there. Uh, you know, everyone up here has talked about digital transformation. You know, to me, it's about the customer experience. We all, are, as developers, need to look at how do we get our products out to our customers and gain that competitive advantage by delivering those services to them. There, there's you know, this dynamic that, that, that's occurring, which is developers kind of want to write stuff quickly, get it tested, and get it out there. But on the other side of things, operations needs to take a more steady approach, being able to look at the stability, manageability, and security of what we're delivering. Uh, so when we look at it, in the past, we've seen these walls being brought up between business and development, between development and operations. What we want to see is, you know, how do we tear these walls down? And so what we want is, you know, the business talking with development, being able to do agile uh, deployment, being able to go from development to operations and ship as quickly as possible. And so, you know, we're fundamentally looking at how can we change the, the equation, being able to then drive that customer experience to our customers. And so what I want to focus on is, all right, this development to operations, this DevOps opportunity, what is it that uh, Pivotal and VMware can, can provide for that? So what we've put together is, what's called Pivotal VMware Cloud Native Stack. Yeah, I, I have problems saying it as well, but you know, that's what it is, Pivotal VMware Cloud Native Stack. What it is is that we have the runtime platform of Pivotal, Pivotal Cloud Foundry, and then we have the Photon platform stack from VMware as the infrastructure underneath that. Most of you already know what uh, Cloud Foundry is since you're here. So let me just talk more about Photon Platform, which is it's a purpose-built IaaS that is intended for cloud-native applications. It can do containers. It can do VMs. Uh, and it's intended for rapid delivery of cloud-native uh, stacks. So we've optimized the feature set. We've decided that you know, things like security and SLA are very important to us, so we make sure that we have that. We want to be able to uh, include features that VMware is uh, well known for, such as NSX and, and uh, vSAN. So we'll be able to provide those as part of that feature set. We took an API first model. You know, everyone is all about uh, how can I write my infrastructure as code? We want to be able to put that into APIs so it has a very uh, rich and robust API set. We want it to be able to scale out. You know, you don't want to only bring up one system. You want it to be able to automatically bring up uh, as much infrastructure as possible and as rapidly as possible. And we have that uh, feature set in Photon Controller. And most of the components are open source. Photon Controller, Photon OS, the Bosch CPI, all open source. So uh, be sure to, to uh, vi visit our uh, GitHub. Uh, you know, VMware loves op open source. We like giving back to the community, so we have some of those components available. Uh, if people haven't seen it in action, please visit our booth. Uh, we'd be happy to give you a demo after this session. And thank you. <laughs>